Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking about BFN on the Switch. I'm a little late to this. Sorry for not uploading. Like I said, I'm not going to be- I don't upload on Mondays or Tuesdays. I have stuff to do. But I'm going to talk about BFN is coming on Switch. And I'm going to talk about what is going to be different for this game. First of all, it's coming on March 19th for $40. The teams are going to be cut back from 12v12 to 8v8. It's going to go from 6 It's going to be locked at 30 FPS. Unlike PlayStation, Xbox, and PC, where you can play at 60 on Switch, it'll be locked at 30 FPS. When you're playing on the TV or docked on the TV, it'll play at 900p, and if you're handheld, it'll be at 720p. There is offline play, you, so it means you can go to G Giddy Park, do free roam regions and private play without an internet connection. There will be motion controls and touch screen, so you can move around and aim by just touching the screen, which would be very interesting. And there's also with the prize map, you can choose whatever you can choose from any of the 12 prize maps at any time. So say. You're in like March, but you want something from like the Christmas prize map. You can just switch over the Christmas quickly, get something from there, and switch back to the March prize map, which is really amazing. I think it's going to be really useful. There's going to be no microtransactions or rainbow stars, so like you can go to Rux and buy skins and stuff, and you don't have to deal with any micro microtransactions. You'll just have to be able to buy your thing with coins, which I think is a very good step, because. When you finish Mr. Rewardtron 9000, you know, the coins are completely useless, so now you can actually do something with the coins. There will be no split screen on Switch, though, and there will be no cross-play, unfortunately. So, it's just gonna be all Switch players, which means if you haven't played the game on Switch, everyone's gonna be complete scrubs, so you're gonna have some good kill easy kills there. Gonna jump back to the fact that we're gonna run a 30 FPS locked at that. I don't know if anyone even didn't see that coming. If you didn't see it coming, you're kind of an idiot. Because we all play Switch, we all know how shit it is. It's going to be locked at 30 FPS. The I guess 720p isn't that bad handheld. I mean, 900p docked is kind of sad because it's not 1080p. But whatever, it's going to be $40, which might sound a little pricey, but it's Battle for Neighborville, the complete edition. So, you know, I mean, there's no, there's no like, Rainbow Stars or microtransactions. So I guess that is a plus because all their consoles and PC have to deal with that. So I'm going to quickly let you watch the trailer itself with all the sound. It's going to lag a bit, and there's going to be some sound issues. Because I don't have that good stuff. And honestly, it might help if you not get copyright strike. So, enjoy this. And thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.